AI is a new area. I think we are still at the beginning of AI. I see AI can impact everybody's everyday life in the future. I'm Bing Xue, Professor of Artificial Intelligence, Deputy Head of the School of Engineering and Computer Science. Hi, I'm Jesse Wood, and I'm studying a PhD in Artificial Intelligence at the Victoria University of Wellington. AI is a science and engineering of making intelligent machines that can sense, act, and learn from experience to perform tasks for humans. If you study with us, this program will uh, teach you not only the current state of us algorithm, tools, and techniques in the uh, area of artificial intelligence, you will also learn fundamental knowledges and theoretical knowledges that enable you to adapt to any new techniques in the future that might come up in the area of artificial intelligence. Uh, we also cover um, social impact, ethical, and other impacts of AI with uh, um, lots of examples in the real world applications. You will learn both uh, theoretical, fundamental, and the practical skills in artificial intelligence, which will enable you to have the, lots of opportunities to develop different kinds of careers in the future. In this program, you will learn a wide range of important techniques and tools in artificial intelligence. You will also have opportunities to work on interesting projects, for example, detecting dolphin clicks from the underwater audio system, and to detect skin cancer from the image from clinic, from doctors, and, and also detect fake news from the website and develop your own tools, for example, to classify images and all other different kinds of interesting and exciting projects we offer. One of the worries I had before starting the course was I'm not the world's best mathematician or some genius programmer moving satellites around when they were 12. When I started the course and actually did it, I realized you definitely learn these skills along the way. And you'd be surprised how intuitive a lot of the concepts can come across when they're taught to you in a way that makes sense. A common misconception about artificial intelligence is that it needs a very strong mass, which you actually don't need. You need some mass and some bit of statistics, and then we will teach you other skills you need for completing the program on artificial intelligence. Victoria University of Wellington was the first one offering postgraduate AI programs in New Zealand. And now we are the first one offering undergraduate AI major in New Zealand as well. Wellington is known as the high-tech creative capital. It's a ICT hub of New Zealand. You will be learning from academics who are world-leading researchers in artificial intelligence. Victoria University of Wellington offers a unique place in the world to have a high impact on the field of artificial intelligence. We have a powerhouse of a research group. Sometimes people think that AI is very hands-off or it's theoretical or something, but we also have a lot of hands-on projects. After you graduate from this program, uh, there are enormous opportunities in the job market. You could work in uh, high-tech companies like uh, Google, Amazon, or Microsoft. You could also work in for um, government agencies and uh, uh, as a, or business consultants in the big firm. And also you could have set up your own startup companies. I've learned through studying this course that you can take something that's, I guess, like a passion or an interest and you can turn it into a full career and that when you do something you're interested in for a job it doesn't really feel like work. <laughs> I guess they say like if you love your job you never work a day in your life. If you want to make a difference and be part of creating technology that will shape our future, join us in unleashing the power of AI.